Well, welcome to another episode of Eversketch. And today we have a common marmoset. It's a little monkey. But, but we're looking at him here, and I've made a little pencil sketch here to speed things along. But basically, we have a triangle. We have another triangle. We got half a circle, another triangle, and another one. That's basically his face. Okay, so I'm gonna work, because I'm using a marker, I'm gonna work my way out. I'm gonna start with an outward stroke, and then I'm going to, he's got a little hairy over overbite here, so I'm using little bitty up, down, little strokes. And I'm gonna point the fur into a certain direction, just like on your dog or cat. And it's just gonna work its way up rest of the shape. So now here there's less fur. So I'm gonna go all the way down to this part because I'm gonna use a smaller pen for that part. Let's just be a, remember where it's gonna do that. Now we get in a nitty gritty of things is the eyes. Now the thing about when you're doing eyes and things of that sort, the light of the eye, and if you have it handy, you get a, uh, a white pen just in case, but you want the lights to be in the same positions on both sides. And with the lighter pen, I can round this off and go from darker to lighter. Now go with the curve. Don't worry about any mistakes. Remember, the, this part here is going to be a lighter. So, I'll use a lighter touch. This shading right there. Yeah, like I said, this takes a little bit of practice. We want to leave some of the light. And you start to see his face start to take shape, shape already. Now these lines right here, still go out, they're going to be, make it a bold one. And we're going to have a, just a bit of shading right here, but let it go from the darkness out. It's forward and reversal. This goes this way, this goes this way. That's the dividing line. It's going one way, it's going the other. Now remember what I said about this. This is skin right here. But we're gonna go a little bit light just to have a little little difference there. Going a little bit light, but work our way out. Leave little gaps of light. We do want some fur in here, so let's give a little now we're gonna go out again. And this is where it starts to get darker. This is where I can be bold. This is where you can be bold. here are kind of white. So we're going to give them a bold edge, tighten it in a little bit. Now if I wanted to, I could actually draw these ones out. I'm gonna... They actually have a, this part where it goes way down, I noticed that. So I'm going to put the nail in and add that piece right there. Nail, add that piece. Nail, add that piece. Nail, add that piece. Back with some more hair in here. Now we got the deep dark. I'm just going to add a little lighter dark. Now this is the finer fur right here. I'm going to do this so far, then I'll come over here and do a little of that. The direction is the key to all of it. Direction and spaces. Space makes light. Get the fur all the way to here. This is not fur that's underneath right there. That is skin. They got knuckles just like you do and leave a little space for their knuckles. I'm 
just going to go a little darker here, just to have depth. Just see as the leg starts to pop out right here. Play with your little illusion. Give that a little texture. And we have a marmoset. We have a website, www papaf.com and when you go to make this your own picture like this feel free to send your own your own samples that you made and send it to the web address that's on this page I think it's in the bottom there and uh, we'd like to see your stuff I might even critique it a little bit and get back to you so uh, till then Papa F signing off for Episketch.